Stop 255. John Coffey, Curator of American and Modern Art. Well, this picture has always bothered me. Really, the title has always bothered me because nobody really has explained convincingly who the Panama dancers were. There were lots of exotic dance troops moving all over Europe before the First World War. However, nobody's ever found one, uh, certainly no dance troupe from Panama. And one night, I had the painting as a screensaver on my computer, and I looked at it. It suddenly clicked that what I was looking at was a cakewalk. The way that the dancers were you know, in couples, the way the, the wrists were bent, the arched back, the high stepping, it was an African-American cakewalk. What was going on in the turn of the 20th century, you had a real flowering of African-American vaudeville performance, not just in this country, but it went on tour in Europe. And there was, in fact, a troupe led by this amazing dancer, and she was known as Aida Overton Walker and the Panama Girls. So it's clear that the artist either saw Aida Walker and her dance troupe or saw a similar group of African-American dancers engaged in the cakewalk and gave the title Panama Dancers to it. And so here we have an interesting connection between a very celebrated German modern artist and an equally celebrated African-American dancer. 